Today we're diving on Jabeda, and what we're doing is we're looking at these extraordinary bait balls that are forming over the wreck. We know that when there are bait balls, there are a lot of hunting fish, and last week we saw an enormous number of hunting kingfish. But I've been told that there are giant barracuda around, and we're looking for one of those. So let's hope we find one. There's a kingfish. When we see these things, we know that there's going to be action because the kingfish hunt when there are bait balls. I'm diving with Renard, chap from France, and he's found a scorpion fish. Take a look. Absolutely beautiful. Venomous spines, but not dangerous. thing is, while I was looking at those fish, I saw through the shadow of, the, of the, the wreck this enormous kingfish hunting. Take a look. He's absolutely huge. And he's like a black shadow. There he goes. Now we're beginning to move off to Bera and we're heading towards three caves, which is where we hope we'll be able to see a barracuda. That's what we're looking for today. We're looking for a giant barracuda because there has been one spotted here. So our hunt today is for a barracuda. Nothing there. Didn't see a single sign of a barracuda. Now, Renard and I are going to go into the caves. This is not easy, it's not common, and we can't often do it. It's very rare that we can actually penetrate this particular cave because it goes straight through into the middle of the island. You have to be a very confident, very self-assured diver because you're actually going into the middle of the island and you're going up 15 meters up into the centre of the island, and there it is. The one thing you need is a good torch and a good pair of fins. And I have to say it was very exciting. Here's a second cave. This one, you don't go right in. This one, you just look at from the outside. Well, that was exciting and dramatic. And I have to say, I've only done this four times. And that cave is really something. It has to be completely calm water or it's quite dangerous. It acts as a blowhole. Now there's a shadow, there's a shadow. Could be the barracuda. This little guy is a moray. And there we have some white lined lionfish. Sweet. And this is a really unusual puffer fish. He's bright yellow, little brown fins, very tame. Now there's the bait ball. There has to be a barracuda somewhere in this bait ball. And it looks as though Renard spotted it down below. I'm going to go down and take a look. And oh my God, there's the barracuda. 
How often do you see something like this? This guy was as big as a shark. I've never seen such a big barracuda. Unbelievable. Very exciting. And exactly what we were looking for. And there he goes. Hovering, waiting for something to eat. Incredible experience. Well, I hope you enjoyed our barracuda hunt, guys. See you next time. Bye.